hello guys in this video i will show you how you can root any android device using magisk but for this method your device bootloader must be unlocked if your device bootloader is locked you can check out my some videos on bootloader unlocking links are in description or you can search on google now i will show you my device information so its model number is x650 infinix hotted light and it is on android 8.1.0 android oreo so guys you are watching tech Ustad. if you are new here make sure to subscribe my channel to never miss any video and if any one of you guys want video on your topic let me know in the comment section or on my instagram i will try to create a video and guys let's get started now go to your pc or laptop and download boot image file for your mobile phone boot image file is different for all mobiles you have to download specifically if you do not know how to download boot image file you can watch my video link is in description so i have already downloaded the boot image file now i will copy this file and paste it into my mobile's internal storage also you have to do the same I will paste in my mobile's internal storage. Now go to your mobile phone and open internal storage. There will be the boot image file. So here is the file. Now go to home. And you have to download two applications Magix Manager and Travel Check. First of all, open Magix Manager. And click on first install button. Allow all the permissions. Then click on next. and click on select and patch a file now browse to the internal storage and select the file the boot image file so here is the internal storage select the boot image file click on let's go so it will patch the file and patching will not take more than one minute go back so go to home and open travel check application you can see it is saying seamless system updates unsupported it means my device has one boot partitions if it is saying supported it means your device has two boot partitions so must check your boot partitions before flashing the boot image file now go to internal storage and see where is the patched image file so open internal storage and the file will be in the download folder so here is the magisk patch.img now open settings and scroll down and open about phone Tap on build number for 7 times, go back and open developer options. Now make sure it is on. Click on OK. Also on an option called USB debugging. Click on OK. Now connect your mobile phone to PC or laptop via data cable. and select the option transfer files your mobile phone drivers will automatically install into your pc or laptop now go to your mobile's internal storage 
so i will go in my device internal storage here it is and here is the magix patched file the image file i moved this file from the download folder to the root directory of internal storage so copy this file so copy this file and paste it into the adb fastboot folder if you want to download the adb fastboot drivers watch my video link is in description so here is the adb fastboot files now here i will create new folder you can give it any name and i will paste the patched file inside this folder now go back and click on the bar at the top here is the address bar so double click on it and type cmd and then hit enter the command prompt will open so here is the cmd now type adb devices and hit enter to check your device is connected to adb server or not so you can see my device serial number but it is saying unauthorized so go to your mobile phone and if it is asking for permission so make sure allow the permission and click on ok now if again i will type again now again if i will type adb devices then hit enter it is not saying unauthorized now type command adb reboot bootloader to boot your device into bootloader and hit enter so you can see my device is in the fast boot mood now type command fast boot devices to make sure device is successfully connected in the fast boot mode now type command fast boot flash boot then space so type command fast boot flash boot space and then go to the folder in which you copied the patched image file so here it is so you have to drag and drop this image file into the cmd so type fast boot flash boot then space and after space drag and drop the file and hit enter So the flashing has been done now type command fastboot reboot to reboot your device So now my device will reboot and the highlighted command is for if your device has one boot partition if your device have two boot partitions do not type the highlighted command type command fastboot flash boot underscore a then after space drag and drop the image file and hit enter then type command fastboot flash boot underscore b and after space drag and drop the image file and hit enter after flashing both partitions a and b type command fastboot reboot and hit enter to reboot your device so i have downloaded root checker to show you my device is rooted or not let me quickly set up it so now i will click on verify root and you can see now it is asking for super user permission 
I will grant it and you can see my device is successfully rooted so guys that's all about this video if you have any question feel free to ask me in the comment section or on my instagram so guys thanks for watching like this video and subscribe my channel for more cool videos like this